Uncle Scott and Nancy. I just wanted to give you an update on the tank. Um, so far, everybody's doing good, and yes, I need to clean it again because <laughs> it's starting to grow some algae. Um, so I did end up having to get rid of the damsels because they thought that the little corals were a snack. Um, so this here is the green star polyp. Um, it's actually recovering. It, it got bit pretty bad. Um, and this is actually your mushroom that you had in there. He's quite happy now. Um, but he's really pretty. Like he glows green. Um, I did add a little emerald crab today wherever he went. He's up here somewhere. Oh, there he is. It's kind of hard to see him in there. He blends right in. Um, so as you can see, I do have some algae starting to grow on the rocks. Um, I've been adding lots of supplements to um, enable the coral to survive a little better. Oh, there we go. There's our emerald. That's a better look at him. He's hard at work already. Um, so then we also added right here I've got a zoanthid. Um, he's been in there for about a week. And this here is an angry zoanthid. It's not going to come out um, today because it just got moved. Um, and then I've got a little trumpet coral starting. And then these two we just added today. And this here is a Tomini Tang. I named her Ursula. But she loves these two. She likes hanging out with them. It's really cute. Uh, your yellow Tang is doing very well. You can see here. Um, Ursula is still scared of them. <laughs> so she hides in the rocks every time they comes out. Um, but they'll, they'll be good. They'll be about the same size. And then they've been getting seaweed snacks. I usually pull them up on the side here, on the clip. And then I did end up putting the heater in the tank um, just to try to get the water temperature more stable. Um, I've been having a hard time keeping the overflow um, beneath in the sump at a steady temperature with it down there. So eventually that'll move. Um, we're gonna get some more live rock in here um, to set up more of a coral base, but this is their little area. And there's their, their fish art above them. <laughs> Nobody here is spoiled, ever. Um, and in the corner here, too, I've also got this little brittle star. He's really like in the corner. You can see his little tentacles moving. He's actually eating. Um, and you had some feather duster worms that were on the rock, um, they're actually starting to pop out more. This one right here is right in the current, so he's kind of eating, but they're so pretty. But yeah, everybody's doing pretty good. Um, the stamsels went to a good home with a nice big tank, um, so they're in good shape too. And. Yeah, <laughs> sorry for the algae. I know I need to scrub it again, but I've been having a hard time keeping it off the sand. So that's why I got those sand sifters in there, like the brittle star and the crab. And there's actually an engineer goby um, hiding in there too. Kind of looks like a little eel. But that is our update. We're about three weeks in right now. So hopefully in the next couple of weeks I'll have some more fun stuff to show you.